Christ, it's Eddie the Magic Monk. Eddie the Magic Monk. Eddie the Magic Monk. Eddie the Magic Monk. Hey guys, Eddie the Magic Monk here, another quick uh, access tutorial and today we're going to talk about validation rules. So what are validation rules? Well basically, let's say in your school, uh, when you're entering the data for your students, you might accidentally enter the wrong year. So for example, let's say you have a student that um, is accidentally born in um, 2001 something like that now that would be very hard because in a high school typically uh, students are not older than 17 so if they're born in 2001 well that's uh, 19 years old so to make sure that your data is correct you sometimes would add in some validation rules so you would do that uh, inside the um, view, the design view of your table and you simply go to the field that you want to add the validation rule for so birth date down here you can see validation rule and what we're simply going to enter is the birth date is going to be bigger than or equal to um, and then just put in a particular date. So for example, 1st of January 2002. Okay, and the date has to be surrounded by a hash um, as required in Access. So if I go back to Design View, save the table, um, and it wants to offer you to check the data, which you should accept just to check against the current data and you can see that um, some data is not fulfilling this requirement so let's have a look yes because I have someone born in 2001 so I'm, gonna, I'm just going to change that quickly to 2004 and let's go back to birthday um, 2002 yes Okay, so now if I try to enter someone that's born in 2001, it's not going to let me. Okay, so now this message is a little bit confusing to read. So to customize this message, oops, 2005, whatever. So to customize this message, I'm going to type a message over here. Okay, so I'm simply going to say you must enter a year um, after 2002 or from 2002 onwards. Okay, so if you go back to save the table, if you enter 2001 or 2000, click out of it it'll say you must enter a year from 2002 onwards okay so 2002 okay then it works all right thanks for watching guys see you next time thanks for watching guys see you next time